Hey guys, welcome back. If you're new here, welcome. My name is Dagny. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button for me. I'd greatly appreciate it. So today we are doing, I, I don't even know. <laughs> I think this trend is like absolutely crazy, but we're doing the blush trend, okay? If you don't know what it is, it, it's using lipstick, which we're going to use red. Let me find my red. Is this red? Yes. <laughs> I'm a little scared to try this, not gonna lie. You put it as blush and blend it out and we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna see what happens, I guess. <laughs> Woo! A little bit scary that things beauty comes up with, I tell ya. So we're going to clip back this hair. Get it out of the way. Okay. I started out with primer. I already put some on a little bit ago because I like to let it soak in, but this is the Poor Professional Hydrate Primer. So we're gonna use this. I'm gonna zoom you in a little bit so you guys can see better. I learned my lesson. I do apologize. <laughs> my other videos have not been zoomed in as much as I'd like them to be. I just got this camera. I don't know how to work it properly, <laughs> but I did figure it out. So let's do this. Let's zoom you in. <laughs> Okay, now you're like <laughs> right up and close. I'm looking on my viewfinder. Hopefully this is good enough. Uh, I don't want too close to my face, so I'll try this, but <sighs> let's do it. Let's do this. Let's try this out, I guess. Guys, lipstick on the face. Who would have thought? I mean, other than your lips. Oh my goodness, I'm starting to regret this. <laughs> okay. That's one side. It's supposed to be really pretty underneath cover up, so hopefully this turns out good because I got a fat fit bum box I want to do for you guys next. Otherwise I'm gonna be taking off all this makeup. That's one side. I'll go ahead and do the other side now. This is a lot of work for blush. I mean, why can't we just put blush <laughs> over foundations like we used to? Nuts. Okay. This side needs a little bit less. This is crazy. This, of course, is falling out. There. Okay. All right, let's do step two and go in with the foundation and see what happens. I'm not going to use the same blending bud, but that one though. Interesting. Sorry, I gotta get more comfortable. <laughs> Interesting. Can you guys still see it? I can a little bit. <laughs> oh my goodness. The things we do. I swear. It's crazy. Well, I can still see it. I hope you guys can. It's a little bit there. I mean, I like, I kind of like the little bit of a red underneath it. It's really pretty. I thought this was going to be crazy insane. Okay, let me go ahead and finish <laughs> the rest of the face and we're going to see what it's look looking like. Okay, what do we think? I can still see it a little bit. Like, I mean, I didn't put on too, too much because I didn't want like crazy red cheeks, but it's not bad. But I think that it's a little bit too much work and it'd be just easier to do, you know, just blush on your <laughs> foundation. I don't know. What do you guys think? Have you tried this yet? Let me know in the comments because this is, that's an interesting trend. <laughs> All right, I'm going to go ahead and finish off the rest of my face. Nothing too special today. And then I'll show you the end result. Okay, I went and finished the rest of my makeup. My, uh, I used 
use <laughs> the Wild Wild West palette or Wild West. Why do I keep saying that? Because of the movie. That's why I keep saying Wild Wild West. And yeah, it went a little more crazy than I expected. I was just going to do a simple look and then I went in with these colors and well, here we are. But anyway, I love the blush underneath. I love the underglow of it. Um, gives you just like kind of a cute rosy cheek. But is it worth the time and effort it took? Because it was a lot to blend out. I don't know. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comments below. And yeah, that's all I have for you today. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you have a fantastic evening. Bye.